Hello friends, welcome to my channel. This is Charan. In this video, I will show you how to display the header text in a grid view control when the table is empty or no records found. So notice here, after adding those two properties, I got the header text on the grid view control as well as the message no records found. Before, the grid view is not displaying. Now we got the header text as well as the message no records form. For this video tutorial, I am creating a new project, file, new, project. I am choosing ASP.NET web application and the .NET framework is 4.6.1. The project name is grid view headers display. Click OK. I'm choosing template empty. Click OK. And the grid view headers display project is successfully created. Open Solution Explorer. Now in this project, I'm adding one .aspx web form page. Right click the project. Add new item. I'm choosing web form headers grid view add now here we got the headers hyphen grid view dot aspx page with a default html5 code now I will add a grid view control between the form and do tag go to toolbox data grid view control I'm adding this grid view control in the center h1 how to display headers when table is empty or no records found horizontal line now the next step is i want to bind this grid view control using the data source sql data source control go to the design mode and notice here the small control here it's a grid view task click that one Choose data source, new data source. I'm choosing SQL database and I'm not changing the ID of the data source. Click OK. New connection user hyphen. After adding the server name, I'm choosing the database name. Sample DB is my user database. Test connection. Is succeeded click OK click next click next now here in the name drop-down control I'm choosing EMP table and selecting all the three columns click next test query and notice this EMP table contains zero rows which means the table is totally empty click finish now after binding the grid view control with the sql data source we'll check the output on the google chrome google chrome and here we got the output of that code but notice the grid view is not displaying now my aim is I want to display the column headers as well as I want to display the message no records found. Let's quickly switch back to the ASP.NET coding part. We'll finish the rest of the code. I'm stopping debugging. Switch to source code. 
Notice here in this grid view on the columns bound field, the header text property is there. But still this employee ID, employee name and email is not displaying on a grid view control. To display this header text of the column names in the grid view, show header when empty is equals to true empty data text is equals to no records font that's it we need to add these two properties in the grid view control let's check the final results on the browser google chrome so notice here after adding those two properties i got the header text on the grid view control as well as the message no records found before the grid view is not displaying now we got the header text as well as the message no records form that's it if you like this video please leave your valuable comment share this video and please subscribe my channel catch you on my upcoming videos